Hey YouTube, Mr. Lupin113 here, and today I'm just going to be making lots of videos. One of the first is this one, my Lego Harry Potter keychains. Then I will make a video on the Forbidden Forest Lego review. Then I'll make a review on the Burrow. And last, but well, kind of least, I'm I'm going to be making some reviews on not reviews walkthrough videos on uh, Prisoner of Azkaban GameCube because I finally figured out how to get past those stupid lanterns. You have to flipendo them at the end. That that totally threw me off. But there's like three sets of them, which kind of sucked. But I'll do that later in the day. So here are my keychains. The first one is Hermione Granger. I got um, her yesterday at the Lego store. One of my favorites, definitely. Because, um, well, all, if, the, all, the only sets you can get Hermione in are Hagrid's Hut and Hogwarts. And, well, you can get her on a lot of sets. That's mostly wrong. But, um, yeah, because I'm not going to get, like, Hogwarts. But I um, am asking for Diagon Alley for Christmas, which would be, like, amazing if I got it. It'd be, like, really awesome. But more details about her. She does not have a double side. She may have a double side face. You just can't turn her hair. It's impossible. They won't let you. Black wand, which I provided her. Did not come with it, because people would just steal wands. Uh, Hogwarts robes. There's the back. Pretty nice hair. And here is my Rumble Roar. I call him Rumble Roar. He has this amazing white wand that I got from the burrow. But what I do is I give this one to Dumbledore and give one of Harry Potter's brown wands to Ginny because it looks so much better on Dumbledore. He got that pretty epic beard, you know. What's Dumbledore without his beard? He got his back. This is Lucius Malfoy's hair without the beard. And it's whiter. He got his little blue light. Mm, it's like a baby blow sort of. Robes. And looks like actually kind of looks like he's in pajamas, but whatever. Now Ron Weasley. Okay, I highly recommend you get a Ron Weasley keychain because the only set you get them in are uh, Diagon Alley, Haggard's Hut, and that's all I know about. If 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 he's in any other like new set, inform me about it because I don't know about it. So that's why I really want to get Diagon Alley for Christmas because they don't have a playable Ron. Because I still play with these guys, but it's kind of harder to. So for Christmas, I really want a Diagon. I'm going to ask for Diagon Alley, Hogwarts Castle, and then, you know, the Battle of Hogwarts, the mini one, that one, and the, um, Hagrid's Hut. Hopefully I'll get, uh, either Diagon Alley or Hogwarts Castle, and then another one. But, okay, um, enough of me, more of the keychains. So this guy is one of my favorite keychains by far. Uh, I provided him with a gray wand. Arthur Weasley's wand, um, is the same color. This is not his wand, though. Back, he, he got, Ron got a new hairdo. He just looked like an idiot with his old hairdo. No offense to those Lego people. And, let me just, double-sided head. Oh, yeah. One of the only Lego keychains I know that have a double-sided head. Well, at least in Harry Potter. Because usually you're not allowed to turn them. And, oh, yeah. Severus Snape. Provided him with the black wand. Cape came with it. Looks amazing on him. Felt that pretty epic suit. Um, his hair can turn, but there's no double-sided head. I will show you. Okay. Yep. She kind of sucks, but yeah. So, if I have to rate them my favorite to least favorite, it'd probably go Snape. Okay, n no, I can't really rate them. They're all so epic. Yeah. So, um, these are the videos. Please comment, rate, subscribe, and thanks for watching, guys.